Welcome back, Slay the Spire, Ascension level 8. Elites are tougher once again, stacking elite damage. That's all fine, no, no worries. We crushed the last run, we're gonna try to do that again. Uh, we don't, do we care about the max HP? This could be good, if we can get to an elite, it might be great. Otherwise it's just mediocre, whatever, we'll take the fancy, what is this? Meow's Lament, enemies have, okay, whatever. Let's see if we can get to the elites, well, what can we do here? Well, there's no elites, and I don't think there typically would be. Oh, I got excited because I saw this one up here. We could go this way because we'll be fresh to fight this elite. And then we can camp here and fight this elite too. Since we're not going to really do much fighting on these first three things. That's, um, that's big brain. Could be a problem. Whatever. He who dares wins. Said it before. It's all good. All right, well, strike this guy, please. Where's my, thank you. All right, um, easy. What you got for me? Blur, poison stab, and cloak and dagger. Uh, all these cards are fine. They don't really send me in a direction. Blur is probably the best card here, maybe? I don't, I don't actually know. Like, these cards are whatever. I'm gonna try to probably force combo because I think that's just the best deck to do. Um, I'm going Cloak and Dagger. It's just generically okay. It's not great. Not a great card. It's just an okay card. Okay. Uh, easy life. Sneka Oil. We can take it. Do we like Crippling Cloud? I think we'll take Crippling Cloud. Alright, here's the shop. What do we want to do in here? Uh, we got Noxious Fumes. I do like Noxious Fumes, and I do think it's worth 70 gold. Terror is also very good, too. I'm not so worried about removing a card yet. I guess I'm taking Noxious Fumes. I think it's great in a lot of things. Um, I do like Lizard Tail. I do like this as well, but I don't have anywhere close to enough gold for that, of course. Uh, a lot of options there. Not sure if I chose the correct one. Kind of wish I'd taken the blur. Uh, we got the elite coming up, and the whole point of doing this is not take damage. I mean, I don't want to take damage there. All right, so kill this dude, and let's see if it was worth my little gambit we're doing here. Give me a good card. Dodge and roll blades dance could be good, but we got a lot of discard stuff. Is dodge and roll even good? It's okay. Are we going to try to go poison mode? I don't really want to go poison mode. Noxious fumes doesn't necessarily mean we have to do that. What What else did I even take? I've already forgotten. Uh, okay, noxious fumes and crippling cloud. They're both poison cards, but they're both just generically okay anyway. Blades dance is deep. I mean, all these cards are just average cards. Do I want Dagger Throw? I'm going to take Dagger Throw. I did say I was going to try to push po uh, combo. Dagger Throw was the combo with card. I don't think it's very good, but you know. Alright, so do we wake this lad up? Probably. Alright, well, there's no Crippling Poisoning him this turn. I, I wanted to play that. He wouldn't let me, and I'm mad. All right, well, um, begin the uh, sadistic destruction of, start poisoning him is what I'm saying. I can't gain all the infinite defense. That's not what I like to hear. I'm gonna take four damage here. Whatever, whatevs, I say. All right, what do you got for me? Um. Well, you hit the neutralize. I love neutralize. I don't know if you've heard that before. Did we just block everything? Probably. I mean, that's that's decent, right? That's what we do. That's what we do up here. It's it's going well for an elite fight, right? That's how that works. 
Alright, beautiful. Gave me a turn to get the poison ramped up a little bit. We are, in fact, a little weaker than we would like to be. Just keep the neutralize on him. This draws me a bunch of cards and randomizes cost. I don't really want to get hit for 4,000 damage, but I guess I'm going to get hit for a little bit. Not much I can do about that. Seven damage. We're taking quite a bit of damage on this fight. I don't know if my little gambit has paid off or not. I think I'm just going to keep blocking as much as I can. Like, he, we got poison. That's the whole point, right? Wish I'd taken the blur earlier, but I didn't know that. The cloak and dagger's fine for it. It still does what you want it to do. Just get in there. Almost. Almost enough. Just slightly disappointing. Go check the recording. It's recording, don't worry. I, I gotta check, I get paranoid. I get scared sometimes. You understand. Poison him to death, I just don't know why I didn't just attack him again. All right, Ginger, I cannot become weakened. That, I don't care, do we care? Regen potion. We got Bouncing Flask. We could have had so many shivs. Whatever, man, just take the Bouncing Flask. We got Poison Mode. Poison Mode again, people. Uh, don't, I don't like poison. It's boring, but that's what we're going for. Okay, so I think we're just going to go ahead and fight this other elite. I don't think I'm going to fight the third one unless it goes swimmingly well. We better rest. I get scared easily. Alright, elite him down. These guys are rough times. Where's my noxious fumes at? Where are they? Guess we'll start with dagger throw. Um, not happy to see it. Let's block again, I guess. The regen potion could come in handy, so I guess it, that elite actually did give us something. I mean, we come, we become weak sometimes. We're like, if we're poison mode, then we don't care about the strength anyway. I mean, we do, but you know, you know what I'm saying. All right, well, the neutralize here will absorb some stuff, so we'll get to do things. I guess we're gonna. Defend again. We'll be able to co recover from this fight with the regen potion. But it's not going too good so far. Not so far at all. It's not going good. Yeah, okay. Alright, so we do want to hit him with a crippling cloud. At least I think we do. And then you yeah, just defend again. Okay, fine. It's going okay. The game's going okay so far. I guess we've only been in like one real fight because we got the the easy enemy thing. Getting a lot of dazed. I don't think this is the combo deck route today as much as I'd like it to be. I think you just you just play the game that you got to play. Which one do we even fight? Does it even matter? Yeah, just defend. Just defend all day. That's what you do with this deck. I mean, that's that's kind of what you have to do, right? Footwork. Need footwork. Need blur. Need a lot of things. I think footwork's the number one card that you want with this deck, though. Unless I'm mistaken. It's just slow and steady. Slow and steady. We got the regen potion to get stuff up. We got the snack oil to hold up a slot until I forget to use it and have to discard it. We got crippling cloud. We got noxious fumes. We got we got some good cards for sure. We sure do. All right. Well, you take this guy with that, and then you dagger throw over here because everybody else is dying. Then you just survive. Or, well, why did I do that? That's something I need to work on. 
Because those cards exhaust, but they don't exhaust themselves if you discard them. So, it's bad play. No matter how you want to look at it. Alright, strike him. Beautiful. The triangles have been defeated once again. Gambling chip at the start of each combat. Discarding a number of cards. Draw that many cards. That card is really good. Corpse Explosion, we want one of those at least. I've seen the Sneaky Strike. I think that's sailed already, unfortunately. There's a lot of Elites going on. Um, this is not great. As much as I'd like to go the double Elite mode, I think I'm going to have to, you know, not do that. Alright, so I can replace. I don't want Corpse Explosion. I don't care about the Strike. I don't know what I'm going to play, but it's not those cards. Okay. He's doing 14 damage. I can block all that. You just got to... You got to put the defense mind first. And then that's that's what you do. Look at that. He ain't even doing damage. He's going to get poisoned here in a minute. It's slow and it's steady. It's kind of reliable, I guess. Sometimes it is. Sometimes it's kind of like, well, I wish my deck was good. Do we just hit him with more poison? We could, or we could just dagger throw. We could just we could just strike and dagger throw and strike again. He's got he's got enough poison, man. We can we can still do attacks too. You don't have to rely on the poison. You're not defined by it. All right, just big boy block mode this time. Guess we're doing this number, because what else we're going to do? We're going to take some damage. Not happy about that. You know, in hindsight, we probably could have bouncing flasks. I don't know if that'd been better than what we did, but I realize now that it's not actually an attack, even though it should be, right? Okay, he is dead to the poison in his veins. Even the torches are green. We got so much poison going around. I guess we're just going all in. I don't know if deadly poison's even worth taking, though, to be honest. Uh, we want to discard some stuff, right? Do I play Bouncing Flask? Those guys are all doing damage. I think we can just go ahead and discard, like, all of these cards, right? I think I'll keep the survivor just in case. Okay, that's a lot better. Now, we probably need to play one of these. Uh, sure. Um, of course we're going to play Dramatic Entrance, because why wouldn't you play that? Alright, can I put Corpse Explosion on one of these dudes and then kill them? That's what we need to do. I can do 12 damage total. That kind of sucks. Can't kill him this turn. I can kill some dudes this turn. So I think you need to do this. That guy's dead, in theory. And then you just uh, you hit one of these other guys. Everybody's going to take 14. So this guy's going to be alive and this guy's going to be alive. So do I just attack them? Or do I defend? I'm, I got decision paralysis here. Oh, math. If I kill a guy, he's not doing six damage, whereas the fan would just block four. I think. This guy's got two life. Um, shame that he's attacking me. Not a fan of that. It is what it is, though. Ghost in a jar could be intangible. I don't know that I love dodge and roll. It's not even strictly better than a basic defend. All right, so we can rest here and then upgrade our stuff at the next thing. And by stuff, I mean probably neutralize. All right, what do you have for me? Um, What's this? That's not what I want. Um, I do want this, though. Why would you not take the lantern? You have to take the lantern. It's free energy, man. It's free! Okay, good day to you, sir. 
All right, what kind of random encounter do you have for me? Please don't screw me over. What is, have I seen this before? Okay, we might find loot or we might monster. We got some gold. All right, I'm out. I'm out. <laughs> I would rather uh, just take what we got and get out of here. Smith and neutralize. I think neutralize what we want to smith, right? Yeah, whatever. It's tradition. Don't break tradition. Don't you ever break tradition. Okay, um, ghosty boy here. That's not the ghosty boy. Why do I always think it's the ghosty boy? Okay, so uh, I think we just want to do the bouncing thing and noxious fumes off the bat here. I think it's what good players do. I don't think the rest of these cards are even relevant. But we do have four energy. I forgot that's a thing. I don't think it really matters, though. I guess we'll strike him. Boom. Got him. We got non poison up in there. Now where's my uh, Sneko skull at? I've had it like three times in a row. I want another one. All right, so I need to do 15 damage. Pretty sure we can do that. That is 15 damage, right? Yeah. Okay, so we just need to put the poison on there. He's going to shift out of attacking us. Did we just dagger throw? Yeah, let's just put more poison on it. That's a that's a thing, right? Okay. Beautiful. He's got all kinds of block up in here. Good thing we got all kinds of venom and stuff. That that's how it works. Alright. Um I guess you survivor and corpse explosion, even though we're overpaying for the amount of poison by a long shot. Like if it actually hits him. He's got too much defense for me to do much else. We'll just block and stand back, as per the usual protocol. Okay, you want to block him, of course. We took some damage. I'm not happy about that. He's going to hit me. Do I want to... I think that's a little ambitious. Let's just crippling poison again. I don't think we shiv. He's got thorns, right? Does he even have thorns? Yeah, he does. I'll take three damage. Um, I think I'll just not shift. We need um, some good block cards. I need footwork. That's what I'm looking for. Number one card we're looking for. Alright, so we need to do 40 damage to get him to shift, which is easily done with Bouncing Flask and Deadly Poison, plus whatever he already had on him. Uh, well, this spot's pretty easy. Look at how much Chunk is doing. I don't know how often we'll get to this level of poison, but if we could get to it often, then you know you would not mind having uh, catalyst. That's the word I'm looking for. I right, probably should have just double defended instead of taking two damage, but I think we'll regen that between the floors. All right, and that's his last turn. What's he going to do now? Nothing. Okay, we'll end the turn. Have a good day, sir. It's a lot of poison up in there. A lot of poison. Alright, so Envenom's okay. I think Adrenaline's what I'm going to take. Envenom's kind of more like a Shiv card than a Poison card. Alright, so gain energy, less cards. Astrolabe does things. I've had some good stuff with the Astrolabe. We can't Smith if we do that. Do I need to Smith more? Or do I just need more energy? The Astrolabe is good because we don't really care about our strikes, but I think like I think the Astrolabe's better for like combo and we're not combo at all. Do I care about smithing? I don't think we really need to smith any of our cards. I'm gonna take this. Plus uh we'll probably end up taking damage and I don't know how much I'll even be able to smith anyway. You know, because we gotta get all rested and stuff. Alright, so let's have a look see. First four went swimmingly well. Oh, well, there's a lot of elites up this way with no resties. I think we'll go to the right. Yep, you just want to go to the right because you have the, the elite here sandwiched in. If you want to go to the shop, you can, but we're not probably going to do that. We're just going to go to the right. We're just going to stay on the right, and it's fine. We'll start here because there's a shop. We could, we could be a patron of that shop. 
Okay, what do we start with? This is why you want all the energy. Do I need these cards? I don't know, get rid of them. Alright, so... We want... Corpse Explosion here. Because that, that's a big boy damage. Do we want Noxious Fumes right now? I don't know that we do. He's doing... 20 damage is a lot of damage. I think I'll play Survivor and think about it. And we'll play Cloak and Dagger and think about it some more. Okay, so... Do I want to do Noxious Fumes or Deadly Poison? I'm not actually that sure. A lot of damage coming in. Let's go with the fast acting deadly poison since we got the corpse explosion on it. Plus these guys are robbers, we ain't got time to sit around for noxious fumes. Noxious fumes probably was more damage than a long shot though. Alright, we'll start off with an adrenaline. Do you just crippling cloud here? Crippling cloud, bouncing flask, I don't really know, but it's a, uh, could be a lot less damage. I'm going to do it because it's cool. It may not be the right call. Um, you just defend. Yeah, you defend. I, th I think I got a little excited here, but I would like to kill these guys before all my gold goes. And they're dead next turn. Like we're, we're taking damage, but it ends the fight a lot faster. It's probably a misplay, but I would like to keep my gold. All right, so these dudes are dead, essentially. I get scared. Let's play. Let's play stuff. Okay, I'm pretty sure the dude's just dead. I haven't done the math, but you know it's corpse explosion. Yep, beautiful. I don't know why I thought I'd had to do the math. All right, skill potion. Uh, I don't think I love Sneko oil. I told you I was going to get rid of that, didn't I? I don't need any of these cards. Good day, sir. We've taken a lot of damage there, though. Need to pay attention to my Rejuve Potion. Alright, so we got... What is this thing? Five cards. Can I pick the cards? I don't know how that works. First time you lose HP each combat, draw three cards. That's okay. I don't think that's that great. We could remove a card and get Noxious Fumes as well. I think that's probably better than doing this. Maybe. I mean, there's only so many cards we want. Like, most of the cards that we want for this deck aren't really that good. Alright, well, I think that's a decent use of our money. Could have been better, I'm sure. Alright, so we gotta go here. Before we go after that, remains to be decided. We got a decent amount of AoE. We got two Noxious Fumes and a Crippling Cloud. Do we care about these cards? Do I care about Deadly Poison either? I don't think I do. The Gambling Chip's good. I do like the Gambling Chip. It's a big deal. Starting with six poison, or six energy is pretty good, to be honest. I think we want to take this dude out, if we can. I think that I want to gain block so I don't take damage I think you crippling cloud and then noxious fumes and then you start focusing to kill something words I right, hit him with a weak I don't really think we need okay I would have played that different if I paid attention to that all right whatever um this might be a good poison deck it's looking good so far all like two turns in It was a pretty smooth first floor too though. Granted we had, you know, easy first fights. Maybe I should pick that option more often. Alright, so we got Bouncing Flask, but I really think we just need to try and kill this dude. You know, because that's the only thing that actually matters here. I'm not really paying attention because that wasn't going to kill him either. There's a lot of damage coming my way, potentially.
Um, let's do it. I might save myself. Uh, yeah, we'll take that. It costs zero this turn, so we'll go ahead and just draw three cards, I guess. Please make up for me being bad. Thank you. That didn't make up for me being bad. That's going to still hit me. Well, there's only like the one dude attacking me. I'm overthinking it. I don't know, man. Like, I get lost in the sauce too easy. Well, this fight's over. We didn't really... We took like one damage. So, you know. Guy's going to die to poison. Then corpse explosion's going to kill everything. And it's all good. All right, in the turn. I do think we have a pretty good poison deck here so far. I don't think the poison deck is great. I'll take this. I don't like the poison deck personally. It's just kind of boring. But, you know. You play what wins, right? Uh, we're in an unassuming cathedral. We can gain 99 gold. I'll take your 99 gold and I'll like it. All right, we got an elite coming up after this bad boy. This thing is kind of a hassle to deal with, but I think we might be okay with uh, some cool stuff. We need to put poison on him, right? He's one of those guys. I mean, is that what we want to do? Maybe. We'll keep him weak for 15 years either way. All right, well, your noxious fumes. Crippling cloud. Neutralize. We'll just name off the cards. That's how we do commentary around here, if you weren't aware. We played a lot of cards, is all I know. I uh, guess that's it. We got the poison build-up started. Is this not the guy with the plated armor? Or is it? I don't know, whatever. All we gotta do is block now. For 15 years. Uh, would like to have drawn more blocks. We don't have them. Should I have just intangible... Should I just intangible still? We do have a rest coming up. And I can do that later. Maybe that's dumb. Alright. Whatever. I thought about it. And I decided not to. We also still have the rejuvenation potion. I need to start using that at some point. But we're going to have to... Uh, we're going to have to rest a little bit, of course. Bouncing flask, nine poison. All up in his grill. Fine, cloak and dagger for a little bitty shiv. All right, beautiful in the turn. Still looking for footwork and other good like block cards. I think we got the poison side of the deck done. I think we just need some more block. 32 poison, you say? I think we just need some more good defensive cards. Duplication potion could be good. Catalyst is probably where we want to be. I think we want a catalyst for sure. All right, we want to rest here. And we might end up popping that Rejuve Potion. We will. We only have 59 HP. Now right, this could be a rough one. Yeah, this guy's kind of rough. All right. So we're going to do this number. Well, I guess we're going to uh, do this thing first. Uh, can we just get rid of most of these cards? I think we can probably just do that number. I can always pop the intangible thing. All right, got Regen on. Heal with the Neutralize. Of course you do. And then you Adrenaline. We're definitely going to play Noxious Fumes no matter what. Do we play the Crippling Poison? We'll just play both Noxious Fumes so we can devote to blocking after this. Well, do I want to use my Intangible Potion? I might. Well, he's only doing a little bit of damage here. So maybe that's just dumb. At some point, we'll use it. And this is a duplication. We don't want to do that just yet. We got all kinds of fumes up in here, by the way. Catalyst isn't worth using just yet. Um, He's doing, what, 15 damage here? So we can block and... 
Survivor. This is looking guy good, boys, right here. This is not the best you could get out of a catalyst, but I think it's like 15 poison for one energy, so I'll do that. We might be wasting a little bit of the Rejuve Potion. It's okay, it's gained us back like 10 health or something. Just focus on blocking, man. What else you gotta do? Uh, just get in there. Alright, so maybe I won't waste too much of this because we're going to take some damage. We're going to take some. Not much, mind you. This is a pretty clean fight. About as clean as you can ask for, I guess. He was blocked for years, man. Just block. All you have to do is block. Let him go. Going to get chip damage again, and then he's dead. Okay, beautiful. End the turn. Gain a little bit of health back, and then he's dead. Alright. Potion belt. I welcome the potion belt. I'll take it. Now, dash is a decent amount of block. I don't know if we really want to dash. We have a bunch of two cost cards already. Acrobatics is a pretty good card. I don't know if it's really where we want to be. I'm taking dash. I think it's kind of kind of lame. I think it's kind of a lame card, but... Do we want to go up this way? There is another elite to fight. I think that I'm going to get risky with it. I think I'm going to get risky. What do we have here? If I pick up, obtain an additional copy of a card in your deck. What card would I want to buy for 144 gold? I don't know if I have anything. I don't think Catalyst is good enough yet to bother with that. And that's almost all of my gold, too. Is there even anything else I would even want? Like, what, Adrenaline? I wonder if it's worth getting another adrenaline. It might be. Yeah, I think I'll do that. I think I will. We got a lot of options, but I think adrenaline's just kind of, kind of just good, right? Gain energy, draw two cards. It's basically better than thinning the deck because you get to draw more cards. So I think I think that's what you do. It's kind of a it's kind of a good poison deck so far. Uh, yeah, that'll do real good for me. Thank you for the pin nib. That's absolutely worthless for me. Uh, so do I want to go up the random encounters, or do I want to go fight this dude? I'll take the randoms. Might be a bad call. Now right, we got the mad gremlin. He does things. Oh. So if I get a Decay, then I get another one in my deck. I would like that Neutralize, though. Well, we definitely want the Decay. I don't remember what any of these cards are. Do I even want Terror in my... I don't think I want Terror in my deck. I want to get, get the Neutralize because I don't want Terror. We didn't get any cards. That's okay. I would have liked to have got the Neutralize, I think. But the fact that we didn't, I'm okay with that. I didn't want the other cards anyway. You usually want Terror, but I think Terror is kind of worthless for this kind of deck. Right, so we got a lot of stuff here. Do I even need these cards? I'll take random cards. Okay, well, I screwed up. Uh, we might just catalyst off the bat. I think we will. Other people get greedy with their catalysts. Not me. Well, I definitely will now. Catalyst for 20 on one energy. Yeah, I think that's pretty respectable. All right, in the turn, Sneko Man is defeated, basically. It's a lot of poison on turn one. I think I do like having at least one catalyst in the deck. I don't know if we have enough stuff to really facilitate more catalysts. Well, I'll overpay for that. Fine. 
Hey, we'll play this and not take damage. Beautiful stuff so far. Beautiful poison deck. It's not as fancy as the discard deck. I understand that. I'm feeling it. But it is it is working pretty well right now. Would like to have a footwork. I've said that a few times. Nobody's listening to me. Do I want another deadly poison? I'll take another deadly poison. I don't think I want a third. I think that's my second. I don't want a third in it. All right, what do you have for me? Give me some uh, crippling poisons and corpse explosions. I think it might be a little early for catalysts. I'll keep deflect because it's free. Strike, don't care about strike. Hmm, yeah. I think we'll just do this. All right, and then we got the adrenaline here. Okay, so how do we want to set this up? Well, first we want to deflect. And then we can neutralize this dude for a minute. Nicky Corpse Explosion here. Noxious Fumes, of course. There's a lot of damage coming at me. So I think I need to be mindful of that. I'm not mathing it, but I did put up a lot of the block there, so Let's see how that works. I would like to have the Sneko Skull. Whichever one transfers poison, and then whichever one adds extra poison, of course, would be delightful. That's adrenaline. Glad we added like 15 adrenalines to the deck, right? Can I just kill this dude this turn? Not quite, but it's close. All right, so he can take a little bit more damage. I don't want to waste um, Bouncing Flask. Maybe that's dumb, though. He's just going to die, right? Maybe I should Bouncing Flask and hope a lot of them hit this guy. But I'm going to take the Guaranteed Poison hit on him. I think that might be more feasible. I don't think I played that great, but... We got Corpse Explosion coming on. We got some... Uh, some poison on the other dude. Okay, so it's just him. Did we just play this? No, nah, I'll, I'll save it for later. Usually I just play the cards, but this time I don't think I will. Let's get rid of it. We'll do the basic strike over here. Don't do a lot of striking, but when I do, I do them basically. He summoned the lads again. Can we kill him this turn? Almost assuredly not. He says he's very angry. I was there. Okay. A lot of damage coming my way, kind of. Do I just kill him? I don't know that I can easily. Oh, well, that was not good. That was probably not the smartest thing for me to do. I was catalyst here for 13. Not great. Not what you can do, but we'll do it. We'll take the dudes down real slow. Probably put way too much effort into killing that guy than I should have. But I don't think it matters. This guy has so much poison coming at him. Can I just kill him? Okay, I might have misplayed a little bit. Good day to you. He's crawling off to die in a corner somewhere. Dreamcatcher, what is this? Whenever you rest, you may add a card into your deck. I've never seen that before. Dude, Alchemize. I love Alchemize. Should I? I don't, I'm taking it. I don't even care. I probably should have took Deflect, but I like Alchemize. Plus, we got the potion belt. You know how it is. Oh, dude, dreaming. Footwork. You're you're my savior, dreamy. Dream catcher. Beautiful, beautiful, handsome feller. Uh, sorry, I went a little weird about it, didn't I? Okay. Um, 
We probably just want to take out a strike, right? Yeah, let's just take out a basic strike. I don't have any curses, do I? Hope not. Probably should have looked better. Dude, this is a this is a good poison deck coming together. Now I can't smith here, but I guess we can add another card to our deck, right? Uh yeah, we can. Thank you. Right, is this the champ again? Alright, we've seen the champ a lot lately. We do have the kind of deck that might do pretty well against the champ. Our right, corpse explosion is kind of worthless here. I don't care about strike, I don't care about the defend. Maybe I should care about the defend. Do I care about Alchemize right now? No. I do need to put some poisons on there, but we'll probably draw some more on the next cards. Hopefully. What I tell you. Alright. So we're gonna start with Noxious Fumes. We'll start with Footwork. Deflect, of course you play Deflect. He's doing all kinds of um, attacks over here. I think we'll just do this to not take damage. Alright. Um, not the best, most efficient use of poison, but you know. You get a little bit going. It's fine. I think we're going to do pretty good. We got footwork. We got noxious fumes. What else can you ask for, right? You can ask for more poison cards on your a turn where he's not attacking. All right. Well, there's Bane. Of course, there's Bane. I guess you just, you just do some damage, man. What are you thinking? I would like a blur in the deck. Would like another blur in the deck. I've passed up one already, I believe. We have a good chance to get another one. Not that we actually have to have it anyway, but you know. Alright, so we can do a lot of stuff here. Do I get greedy? We can do Catalyst later. I don't need to get greedy and stupid. Uh, this is 10 block, right? Well, it's going to give me 15 block. It's still whatever. You play it safe. And then we'll just, uh, we'll bounce some flask. It's all about safety, friends. It's the, it's the poison deck. You worry about not taking damage first and doing damage later. I've learned that. Sometimes it's kind of rough. Hopefully we don't fight the bird dog later. We fight the, uh, the time lord, I guess. Or whoever. Just not the bird dog, just... Put some poison up in this grill, man. That's all you need to do. We don't need to attack through anything. You just keep poisoning, even if you're overpaying for the poison. We draw that catalyst again, it'll be pretty. Well, I can't get weak because I got the ginger snaps up there. Not that it matters. All right, well, we're going to deadly poison here. Then we're going to alchemize. You know I love an alchemize. What do we get? A weak potion? That might be good here in just a second. I uh, guess we'll do one damage. We also have duplication potions. Okay, those are good stuff. I need to start using them though, so I'll have room. When he goes for his big boy, I can do the intangible. If I draw a catalyst, I can do the duplication. What I say? Maybe I'll just use both. Why not both, he says. All right, where's my duplication potion? Drink, and then we catalyst. You catalyst again. Now he's doing 31 damage here. What's this going to give me? 14 block? Do I want to use my ghost in the jar? I think I do. I think that I do. That way we start the next four strong. Might be a little worthless because he's just dead here, but I did save 30 damage there. And um, stuff like that. He's got 191 poison. We'll see you later. Maybe I did waste the intangible potion. Maybe not. I don't really want to take 20 damage. Um, I don't think we want any of these cards. Alright, what do we got here? Remove two cards in the deck. Could get rid of strikes. Gain energy. Start your turn. You can no longer rest. That's not going to happen. Whenever you open a non-boss chest, obtain a curse. I don't really want no curses. Let's just get rid of the strikes. Alright. 
Um, beautiful. We already got some energy stuff going on, so we may have gotten by with it. All right, so we got the the weird donut brothers up here, so maybe it'll be fine. I think I'm gonna go up the left here. Kind of an odd thing. We can get there without fighting any elites. There's a lot of ways to go though. Could go up the right here. We only have to fight like one dude before the elite. And then we could, in theory, fight like a bunch of elites. Oh, uh, let's let's do that. It might be stupid though. Nah, it's great. It's good it's good stuff. We got poison deck. We ain't scared. Now that I got footwork, we got a lot of stuff uh, shored up that we had problems with before. I need dash. And uh, I don't need Bane right now. I don't know if I need 43 block cards. Whatever. Alright, well, we're playing footwork no matter what. And then you play adrenaline again no matter what. Okay, well, uh, might as well just play another one, I guess. We have all kinds of energy. All right, so here's how you do it. The corpse explosion here. First thing. We'll get all kinds of block up too. Don't think I forgot the block. Oh, dude, we need to kill this guy. I forgot about that. Oh, uh, as long as we just take these dudes down, it doesn't matter. Uh, discard this. And play another defend. I have 26 blocks, so I guess I'll just strike here. That way our corpse explosion can actually kill him. I would have put corpse explosion on the this guy. In fact, it makes more sense to put corpse explosion here because it has more health anyway. That's just dumb of me. I don't think it's going to matter, but it is bad play. Do we just crippling cloud everybody? Why not? I don't think it really matters. Like, we can't lose this. I'm going to alchemize. What do we get? Dexterity potion? That could come in big handy. Came out weird. All right, we'll, we'll take one damage. Looking to uh, finish off this corpse explodey guy here in just a second. Probably need to. This this guy's going to blow up the next turn, right? Okay, I, I needed to do some damage to this guy. Can I kill him this turn? Well, he's already dead, so I guess that works out. Why am I overthinking it? He's already dead. This Catalyst here, why not? Any noxious fumes, and um, that's it. Game over. They're all dead. Good day to you. It looks cool. That guy tried to blow up, but I actually blew it up for him. Uh, do I want any of these cards? No. No, I don't. Okay, random encounter, be kind. This thing. This thing is. whatever. Uh, I don't want Corpse Explosion. Dagger Throw's worthless. Do we want Bane? We could do Bane. We could do a lot of things. He's attacking me for what? 11? I should keep that and get rid of this. Uh, sure. I do like me a gambling chip, by the way. Play Footwork. Play that fancy stuff. All right, we got mostly enough of that. Uh, I'll play Alchemize just to get my potion for free. Strength potion, not really worthwhile to me, but we'll take it. Nine potion, big boy potion damage. Poison damage, I get the words confused. You just have to overlook me sometimes, no big deal. Okay, well, um, we have stuff, but... I need to have more block. Do I have a thing that gives me more block? Do I use the weak potion here? Maybe. I want to stay pretty healthy. I didn't really do as much as I wanted it to. Well, we're going to take some damage. The weak potion probably was wasted. I need some room. No big deal. 
The strength potion is probably kind of worthless for me, though. Alright. Doing fancy stuff here. He's got 11 poison on him. That's not quite that much. Oh, well, there's the block. Do I just go ahead and... Yeah, just Catalyst for 11. That's fine. It's plenty of damage. Fight's going in a couple turns anyway. Don't get too greedy with the Catalyst. You just play it when you can. Well, pretty sure the game's over. That's going to be just enough. Beautiful stuff here. Alright, 39 poison damage. I took two from burn. I'm mad about it. I forgot about it. Anyways, he's dead. Blessing of the Forge could be useful. Do we want another Crippling Cloud? I don't think we do. I don't want any of these cards. I think the one Crippling Cloud's good enough. Um, yeah, let's go here. Do we buy things? What do you have... Do I want Deflect? Or do I want to remove a card? Let's just remove a card. I think that's probably the better thing. We can just get rid of uh, the basic strike. I think that's what we need to do, right? Yeah. Yeah, it is. Hey, beautiful. I take out all the strikes all the time. We got a lot of potions to help me on this elite fight. We'll probably need it. Duplicate a card in your deck. Um, do I want it to be Catalyst? Or do I want it to be Adrenaline? We do spend a lot of time setting up. Uh, I think I'm going to duplicate Adrenaline again. Is that dumb? Maybe. Our first turn is the most important turn here. we got to have a lot of setup stuff. and We get the draw and we get the energy, so that's what we want. Alright, so I need Corpse Explosion... Uh, I, I can't think. We'll just do that. Alright, so footwork goes first. And then corpse explosion on the big dude over here. Okay. And then we want dash? Do we want dash? It will block a lot of stuff. So does this. Should we just put the deadly poison on here? Because it'll kill him faster? Let's put the deadly poison here. And then we'll just block. I kind of misplayed this. That's okay though. Happens. Alright, so we got the block. We got a lot of poison going on. These guys will die to corpse explosion when it happens. Seems good. You just sit back. You block. That's all you need to do. We got the poison deck. We got a good poison deck at that. Alright, well, um... These guys are attacking me. They're getting very frisky, apparently. That's okay. We got blocks for days. Do we do the crippling cloud? Yeah, it'll save some damage. Plus, it does some damage. I'm going to play Alchemize to get me some good, fancy stuff. Was this 14 damage? Whatever. Bane him. Cloak and Dagger. Defend. Shiv this lad. Alright. There you go. Um, he's almost dead. I haven't mathed it, but I'm sure we're taking some damage. We're taking a little bit of damage. Not a lot. Four damage on a fight like this? I'll take it. I'll take it. I don't love it, but you know. Alright. The dude's just dead, so that should be the end of this, right? Thank you, Corpse Explosions. Good card good day to you where's my cards at thank you weak potion we'll get rid of the, the strength potion for the weak potion do I want another bouncing flask I think I do my cards are probably going to start getting congested here but you know alright so I need to try here because these guys are rough times right, I don't need corpse explosion right now I probably don't need catalyst right now do I need defense? Do I need Bane? I don't need any of these cards. I will keep the dash. Okay. Okay, there's some cards here. Um, Blessing of the Forge. Let's go ahead and big boy those. Ooh, 
we got a lot of stuff that's going to happen here. We got a lot of energy going on. All right, noxious fumes. I don't know that we need to use any more potions here for this. Okay. Do bouncing flask. We can just use dash just to get the blocks up. You know, you know. Deadly poison, of course. Noxious fumes again. And then we'll just hit them with uh, a little shiv. That's productive turn. It's not the best turn, but it's okay. We need to kill this guy pretty fast because he starts doing damage when he's done counting. And he does big boy damage too. I failed it last time. All right, so might as well hit him with neutralize. Adrenaline. Deadly poison. Bouncing flask. And then we'll just hit him with a crippling cloud too because why not? You can just get all the poison up there all day. 38 poison is pretty big poison. I'd like to draw a catalyst here soon. Can't lower our strength, and we don't care if he does lower the strength anyway. All right, so he's not attacking us again, so we'll do Bouncing Flask. Of course we will. Um, Alchemize, because it's free. What is that, a Thorns Potion? It's kind of worthless, but sure. All right, end of the turn. I like to play Alchemize whenever I see it, because it's you know free potions. Those are like 50 gold a pop or whatever, so we get value out of it every turn. Right, so I do need to start focusing on killing this guy. Let's bane him out. Uh, let's stack our throw and see what happens. Oh, we saw what happened. I can't play them both? Is it worth it? We can catalyst for... This. Go on, take nine damage. I need to not take damage though, right? Do I even need to do a catalyst this turn? I do need to end the game pretty quick. I'm gonna be a good player and just not do that. I'm gonna I'm gonna let the poison build up. We can draw another catalyst here real soon. He's gonna start doing damage, so maybe maybe I did screw up. Maybe I did screw it up a little bit. I'm sorry. All right, dash. We'll get some block up in here. Get some more block in here. Let's we'll play all kinds of block. I don't think that's a good call for me, though. He's only doing 30 damage. No big deal. I think we probably should have just took the 9 and catalyst him. Probably should have done that. This could go pretty south, because it's not good. I mean, I can pop more potions, but who wants to do that? Where's my catalyst? No? Okay. Alright. I think I'm going to have to pop more dexterity. That's kind of lame. We'll weaken him. That'll be a big deal. Okay. Beautiful. We're not taking damage, but I did waste a potion. But it might be worth it. Like, we're a potion down when I could be 9 damage now. Okay, so we can just probably Bouncing Flask plus Catalyst and just kill him, right? Yeah, beautiful. Alright, so I'm a Potion down instead of 9 health down. You tell me which one's better. I'm not real sure. I think the Potion down is probably better because we have so many. Alright, Preserved Insect. Enemies in Elite Combat have 25% less HP. That's decent. I don't know if we have any more coming up. Um, don't care about these cards. Oh, we have another elite coming up right here, actually. We're going to rest. We'll get a ca good card. Where's my good card? Never mind. Don't care about those cards. Let's go. All right, so here's our elite. It's going to start with 25% less HP. We might just hit all the elites, man. I'm not real sure how to fight these guys. I'm sure I'll get told. I don't need Catalyst right now. I don't think I need any of these cards specifically right now. I'd rather just draw random cards. Do I want Bouncing Flask? No, nah, just give me a random new hand. Give, give me a new hand. I don't know that that was worth it. Okay. So. 
Let's start off with Bouncing Flask and see what happens. Okay, so this guy will die in like two turns. In theory. Who is? I don't know. Is that what you want to do? Let's play Alchemist, see what happens. That's a Sneko Oil. I don't like that. Play Deflect. So that's 26 damage. Oh, I got pen nib going on. Okay, I understand. I understand. Let's pen nib this guy then. I was wondering what was going on with that. It's not telling how many times I've screwed up the pen nib thing. I've like literally not even been looking at it. Oh, he just summons up another snake dude. I need to draw my AoE stuff and my noxious fumes, I guess. Okay, so we can corpse. Exp can we just kill this guy? He has 11 HP. Okay, I need to do like what two more damage to him. And cloak and dagger. Shiv him. Now he's dead. All right, adrenaline. Did we just do the? I don't want to take 4,000 damage, but I don't think I can do anything about it. 34 damage. We could pop Sneko oil. Uh, well, I don't think that worked out very well for me. Get the free Noxious Fumes. That does not work out for me. I should have played the other cards in my hand first. 34 damage coming my way. Can I do anything about that? I can give him weak. Might be worth it. Yeah, that's worth it for sure. Alright, then I guess we're just going to defend. Um, that turn kind of went south real quick. Thanks, Sneko Oil. I hate all the Sneko stuff. Like, I want all my cards to have the same cost that they're supposed to have. Just took 15 damage there. That's no big deal. Right, so he's going to summon up another dude, I assume, here. Just, just flask him. And then dagger, because what else can you do? And um, that's about it. And I guess we'll go straight for him. We'll just ignore his uh, his minion he's got here. I guess you just dash. Just 13 block. Uh, do that. Do we just block some more here? It's doing damage. Doing a lot of damage. We're not coming out of this elite fight too good. We're not doing too good on this one. Probably could have played it a little bit cleaner. But we could have drawn better too. Alright, so. I need to kill this guy this turn. Can I kill him this turn? I can kill him this turn if the Bouncing Flask goes well. It went pretty well. Uh... We can Duplication Potion, and that'll end the fight this turn. Okay, that was... Will that not end the fight this turn? Am I insane? What have I done? Why did I think that would end the fight? Okay, well, um, it didn't. So I'm gonna take 25 damage that I shouldn't have because I played bad. I don't know what I was thinking, but it wasn't what I needed to be thinking. That's bad news. That's bad news for sure. I think there was another uh, rest spot. But still, man, that's... We were doing good until I came into this fight. Caliper is the start of your turn. Lose 15 block rather than all your block. That's kind of like a bad uh, blur. Alright, so we are going to have to fight this elite with some weakness going on. Art of War, if you're not playing any attacks during your turn, gain it. We could do that, because we don't ever play attacks, I don't think. What we got? I don't need any of those cards. 
All right, so I did say we we're going to fight the elite, but then I didn't realize that we could, you know, choose not to fight the elite. I think that that would be the best case scenario. We kind of screwed the last one. Maybe I should have fought the elite because I hate fighting this dude. Hate this dude. Okay, we want. I don't think this is good cost efficiency. We can do a lot with Catalyst this turn. We just, I don't know. We can do a lot of stuff with Catalyst. It's fine, don't worry about it. This is not the biggest Catalyst. I've never played the biggest Catalyst here, but adding 17 poison for one energy is pretty good. All right, so do you defend? I think we better defend. I think we better do that. I would like to have played Alchemize. It didn't happen though. Nine damage. We got we got some campy. I don't know if it's gonna be good enough for the campies. So I kinda just need to block a lot now. Just dash him. I always put dash on myself for some reason. Okay, well, um, whatever you're doing, it's probably better than hitting me. Well, no, it's not, because I put a ton of block up this turn. Yeah, it was not better than just taking the hit. So was that 27 damage? Yeah, that's not nothing. Don't worry about that. We're taking damage, but I think we'll get out of here pretty decently. How much do I need to block? A lot is the answer. Okay, so do we want Bouncing Flask or do we want Noxious Poison plus this thing? Just, just Flask him. Okay, he's dead in two turns, so hopefully we can put a lot of block up next turn. Draw an Alchemize would be nice. Give me my Alchemize, please. No? Okay. Well, he's dead, so... We're not going to have a lot of potions to go into the boss fight like I'd hoped. We've had to use them. Uh, that's a nice pickup. Uh, do we want another bouncing flask? I might want the Bane instead. There's a, it's multi-enemy fight, so Bane's more targeted. All right, we got two campies, so if we don't die here, we're doing okay. We're doing okay. We shouldn't die here. Give me corpse explosion. Give me some good stuff. All right, well, parasite will get rid of you. Wish it wasn't there, but you know how it is. Can I afford to play Alchemize here? Probably. I can probably afford to play Alchemize here. Do I need Noxious Fumes? Maybe. Um, hopefully we draw some good cards. Because I didn't do very well with my selections. Alright, so Crippling Cloud will reduce a lot of damage here. I think you play Footwork. I think you play Noxious Fumes. And then I think you play dash. Do you play dash? It's got 14 damage coming my way and we can get 15 block. So, yeah, that makes sense to me. Hopefully we draw an alchemize here soon. And I, well, corpse explosion is what I really want to draw, right? I guess it doesn't really matter what we draw. Like, I, I think it's a pretty easy fight. At least if you're not just, you know, shiving the those spike dudes down. Alright, Corpse Explosion's where you want to be. Of course it is. Alright, so he ain't dead yet, but he's close, right? Did we just catalyst him? It's kind of lame, but I do want him to just be dead this turn. It's a big catalyst, isn't it? Alright, do damage there. Uh, is anybody attacking me? No. So I guess we'll just... Uh, in the turn. All right, let's we'll see how much we get to deal with here. Okay, so we got some poison going on still. We got one holdout over here. Just, just flask them. They go. Can you hit the other one? Okay, well, he hit the other one, but he didn't really hit him very much. 
Uh, we'll, we'll do this for posterity. I'm not attacking with Bane because it's going to do damage. Uh, this dude's dead. This dude will be dead next turn. This big old spiky boys. I don't like them. But they, they got the poison deck to contend with and they don't like that either. Alright, good day to you. Alright, give me a good card. Do we want deflect? I'll take deflect. I don't know if it's a good idea, but I'll take it. Alright, so we can do the dubs heal. Dubs cards. I don't think I want another deflect. I have like two or three already in there. I'm just going to not do that. Alright, random encounter, please be a good one. Just don't destroy my deck. Okay. Um, I'm just going to get a cloak and dagger. I think I think we're okay with losing that. All right, you rest again. Okay. Do we want any of these cards? I think I've already got enough deadly poisons. Uh, the deck's mostly got what it needs. All right. So these guys are rough times. Can be. Whatever. I'm done done talking. We're just gonna go in there. We're gonna kill some donuts and stuff. Oh yeah, we gotta fight through like four thousand uh, things here. All right, we got noxious fumes. I want to keep that in my hand. This guy's attacking for 24. What do we want to do about that? Do I keep the deflects? We got here thorns, draw cards. But I want to keep the noxious fumes for sure. The rest can go. I don't know how much I actually like bouncing flask here because I want to take out Donut King first. I guess that we'll keep the Bouncing Flask because it's going to eat um, a lot of the artifact charges anyway. Alright, let's do that. Hopefully draw some good block cards. We did draw Footwork. Alright, so... Blessing of the Forge. Beautiful thing. Thorns. Uh, we don't need the draw card just yet. Okay, so let's start doing things. Why did I not play Footwork first? This is supposed to be the Try Hard mode, right? right so you get Noxious Fumes. You got Bouncing Flask. This is going to eat a lot of stuff here. Alright, well, let's hit the donut. That's fine with me. Alright, we got... We can gain 11 block, which will mostly negate this attack. I think that's probably what we should do. If I'd played the cards right, then we would be taking probably no damage, but that's okay. It's okay. We got stuff set up. We got thorns. We got... We got Noxious Fumes, we got Dexterity, that's a big big setup turn. We can win this. We can do a real good stuff here. Alright, well, you're gonna play this. Dude's trying to hit me for 30. I see you over there trying to do that. Okay, we got a Catalyst, but I don't think I want to play it yet. I do think I want to play another Noxious Fumes. Uh, this will apply weak to both of them, so I think it's probably worth it. I forgot about this dude's last artifact hit, so that's fine. Okay, so... We really need to get some block on here, and I don't really have much block. Let's go ahead and draw some cards. Okay, that might have been worth it. Do I play Corpse Explosion on the one dude? Maybe. Maybe. Let's go ahead and ditch the the dagger throw. I'm not worried about that. Uh, do we play? Let's play adrenaline. Draw two cards, get our energy. We got four energy now. Do we do like the corpse explosion plus dash mode here? Maybe. Maybe because when he dies, then he'll just corpse explode this dude, and that's that's good eats. Alright, so we did a lot of stuff on that turn. I don't know if we did good stuff on that turn, but we did stuff. We we negated their turn. Kind of. Alright, I don't care about your, your block, really. We still got the catalyst in the deck for later. Okay, so we got another corpse explosion, which is not ideal. Just keep him weak for years, I guess, right? Don't really have much else going on. Like, we can just play cards now. As soon as we get the donut dead, though, like, 
It's good eats, man. I don't know if we're going to last that long, but we're going to try. We don't have a ton of HP. And they're getting big boy strong. Alright, so I think we dash. We're getting some block here. Alright, they're doing 36 damage in block, so I think you want to, uh... If you catalyst and do double block, right? It's not the biggest catalyst, but I think it's probably big enough. That's what she said. It's going to be rough times. So it's going to be close. We only have to weather like three more turns. It's only going to need two more two more turns. That's it. All we got to do is wait two more turns. He's doing 26 damage. That's not, that's not big boy damage. That's fine, man. I got stuff I can do. I guess we'll bouncing flask and hope it hits well. It has. Like, he's going to just die in two hits, right? This guy might absorb some damage with a block. Maybe. I think we might be doing pretty good. I think we might be in the clear. But this is, is this going to do two stacks of course explosion damage? I think we might be in the clear, boys. Kind of scary. But I think we've got it. You just you just do all the block just in case some kind of shenanigans happen. And he's dead to the poison damage. And then you see what happens. You just let the dial roll and see. There you go. It's poison. He's caught corpse exploded. There you go. The donut has taken his friend with him. We have defeated and We have uh, words. We have succeeded in defeating the beyond once again. Uh, we'll never defeat the heart. I don't know if you're even supposed to defeat the heart. But you know. All right, what do you got for me? Um, Ascension level nine unlocked. Absolutely. We'll see you there.